So we are getting more and more details on Maximum Football as football season is starting to ramp up. You see the spring games and everything in college football, and obviously the NFL draft is coming this week, and people are starting to get an itch for a football game, and Maximum Football looks to provide that in their newest installation and really pr pretty much a completely new game from what we've seen you know the last maximum football i mean this looks different now if you follow them on twitter you will get updated on this game unfortunately there is no release date for this but there are rumors that it could be soon because they do have a steam wish list you can sign up for go follow them over on twitter max football game at max football game and they will keep you up to date there you can also join their discord as well and they keep a lot of information there you can see a lot of screenshots obviously there's not too much gameplay there are some leaked uh youtube videos go and check those out i won't link those though but you can obviously look those up but we did get a feature set from their recent faq so let's just go over uh some of the features on this and obviously this was the big one the unmatched realism and physics with the unreal engine 5 and you are now in an era where you need physics in sports titles like it's just a necessary evil i mean to be honest like obviously people are going to complain about each game and how each game looks and i think they got to nail this one i think this is the one thing that's going to get people into playing the game and i've seen some you know interesting feedback from the ncaa community on like the uh trailer and the developer uh gameplay footage that we've seen from this game it's been up and down like i actually think it looks pretty good like it's not gonna be perfect it looks pretty good but they do need to nail it like it needs to be solid enough to play for an extended period of time before getting sick of it but i think they could uh have a really good game if they have good gameplay it doesn't need to be great and obviously not perfect but it needs to just be good dynasty mode we obviously want this in the game we don't have an option right now for a new NCAA game or even any type of, you know, Canadian football game that gives us like a deep dynasty mode where I can recruit, where I can, you know, build my team up and build my own league. And in Maximum Football, you can do that. There is a full customization. They have confirmed it that you can create custom teams. You can use the built-in teams that they have in the game. So that is awesome. And then the endless customization here at point number three, this is the thing that is probably the coolest about this game that I know for a fact EA Sports is probably not going to put that in their NCAA football game. They are probably just going to make it so that you have the base teams and that's it. But here in maximum football you will have full customizations we're talking uniforms we're talking entire team rosters and they have said that you can share this i don't know exactly to what extent you can share it but i'm pretty sure you can share custom teams i don't know if you can share like the entire league like you can on nba 2k if that's possible that would be amazing but look at the customizations here you got colors and they have the RGB slider, so you can get it exactly what you want in the game, which is awesome. And you can build up your league, build up your team in a dynasty, which is pretty awesome, to be honest. So I am very, very excited about that. And hopefully, you know, that's something that, you know, is actually stable in the game. Um, the next point, local and online multiplayer. So there will be uh, online head to head, but dynasty could come later they have said that you know it won't be available right away for online dynasties but it could be something that could be introduced later on but you know having something that's online is pretty much standard nowadays and then ongoing content they will continue to add to the game which is awesome and just to note this is a free to play game so this is free to everybody my thought is that they're probably going to release it on steam first and then eventually move it over to consoles i think that it's just easier on steam right now so i think uh just for timeline sake and probably you know ease of pushing updates out they will probably have a stable platform they're on at first which is steam and then probably roll it out so some additional FAQs they had. Um, will there be a roster jersey in Team Community Share? Now, 
this was interesting because um in this question they said you can import almost any image you want so i'm guessing that probably if you're uploading some profanity maybe you can't do it uh but you can change any of the team colors patterns equipment all of that and edit your rosters as much as you want i'm pretty sure that's what it is they just talking about like profanities and things like that uh can you make your own playbooks you will be able to create your own playbook from the launch and then custom plays will be added in a future update after launch so that lets me know that there's going to be a play creator of some sort so that is going to be awesome now there is pretty much no video game in the current gen that allows that right now like it's pretty much just the old uh you know if you just go through the old ps2 games those games you know kind of allow that but not anymore like i don't understand like why more features get taken out of games i'll never understand that to be honest with you and then the final faq here that they left um this was from last friday will you launch with online multiplayer i kind of already talked about it um and they will start to work on franchise and multiplayer after launch but dynasty mode will be playable just offline for now and then obviously down the road uh they will introduce that to the game so that's pretty cool um i think that that is probably the correct direction to go because if it's not fully ready do not release it with a bunch of bugs make sure you get the gameplay down before anything else but i do like these updates but we just don't know on release like that is kind of what we're waiting for and i don't want it to be a situation where they're going to delay it like a year or delay it you know nine months because then you're pretty much on par with ea because ea delayed their game uh, a whole nother year and you kind of want to be a little bit ahead of them and get something out there have the people talking and really excited about your game but it starts with that gameplay if you played maximum football in the past you know how customizable the dynasty was even on the old games so having that in kind of a newer setting the unreal engine 5 that's gonna be awesome i can't wait to see this product let me know if you guys are even excited for this game i think i am i do want to try out you know some other games such as access football see what those uh triple a titles are like this is a triple a title it's gonna be free to play for everybody so let me know your thoughts down below